more amazing animal defenses. Today, we are going to learn more about some amazing kinds of physical defenses that animals use to avoid predators. Many of these defense mechanisms are painful, like a bee sting. Some can even result in a predator's death, though most aren't quite so dangerous. But they are all vital to the survival of the animals who use them. Ready to learn more? Let's get into it. Up first is venom. Venom is a liquid with special chemicals that can hurt, paralyze, or kill other animals. Some animals, like coral snakes, have venom glands connected to their fangs. Others, like the Gila monster, have venom in their saliva. Claws are another physical defense. They are the curved, pointed parts at the ends of an animal's fingers or toes. Claws are made of keratin, just like human fingernails. Eagles have special claws called talons that are great for gripping and scratching. Have you ever been accidentally bitten by a cat or a dog? Teeth are another defense mechanism. Teeth come in different shapes and sizes for different jobs. Carnivores like lions and wolves have super sharp teeth to cut meat and protect themselves. When animals bite, it is usually a warning or a sign that they feel threatened. Antlers grow on the heads of male animals like elk and moose. They are made of bone and fall off and grow back every year. Antlers are used to fight for mates and defend against predators. When threatened, a moose will lower its head and charge, using its large antlers as a shield or a battering ram. Similar to antlers are horns. Horns, however, are permanent and have a bony core covered by a layer of keratin. Animals like buffalo use their horns to fight off attackers. A rhino can use its big horn to charge and protect itself if a predator, like a lion, attacks. Ever seen an elephant or a warthog? Their extra large teeth are called tusks. Tusks are made of dentine, which is a hard material also found in regular teeth. Elephants use their tusks to dig, peel bark, and defend themselves, taking large swings if something dangerous is near. Anybody who has ever been stung knows that stingers can be super painful. A stinger is a small, sharp tool that delivers venom. Bees and wasps, and even sea creatures like jellyfish, use stingers. As you would imagine, stinging is a strong warning to leave an animal alone. Last are hooves, the tough coverings at the end of the legs of animals like horses, deer, and zebras. Like claws and horns, hooves are made of keratin. When threatened, these animals can use their strong hind legs to kick backwards. Hard enough to break bones. That's why you should never stand right behind a horse. Thanks for learning with us. In case you missed it, we have another video about defense mechanisms called Amazing Animal Defenses and talks even more about this interesting topic. If you had to pick... Which physical defense mechanism would you choose? Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.